Well, hello there, it's me, Nasmus, and today is a special day because Minecraft Education Edition has been released in a preview. So, if you're a teacher, a student, or a school administrator, you can get started and download and try out Minecraft Education Edition. But um, if you're unable to do that, that's where I come in. I'm going to show you exactly what the gameplay is like for Minecraft Education Edition. Guys, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you like content like this. I'll have more gaming videos up on my channel so you will be notified if you subscribe. So let's get right to it. To begin, you want to go to education.minecraft.net and you get to this page uh, as of now. And all you have to do is click the green get started button. You can still see the old Steve with the beard, which I always thought looked like a smiley face. And Alex here. And you could see some, uh, they're making an education, uh, like a uh, molecule with the grass and things uh, spawning out so it's very cool like organic chemistry with minecraft so click the green get started button and we're off we go so all you have to do is select whether you're an educator student administrator or student um, you will need to log in with a proper account uh, with a school account or with your microsoft account if your teacher has approved your account as eligible as selected uh, set your account as eligible so so i typed in my uh school account I'm going to click submit and then I'll be taken to my school's portal where I can log into um, uh, actually I'm not asked for a password I just I'm taken to the download page so all I have to do is choose whether I'm playing it on Windows or OS 10 so if you have a Mac uh, you get the OS 10 version if you have Windows get the Windows version and you will need Windows 10 because this is the same version as Windows 10 Minecraft Windows 10 edition as we'll see in a bit uh, you also have option for support and you have some um, uh, some uh, more information so I already downloaded it for you so you don't have to wait for, for it to download we don't have to wait watch watch the download bar fill so let's go and see what we have so we're going to open my downloads folder and when you download this you get this option minecraft education edition the full name is uh, win 10 so all you have to do is extract the file I have 7 zip so you could have if you have 7 zip uh, make sure click here and click extract files or if you if you don't have 7 zip you'll be able to open it with windows explorer so we're going to click 7 zip extract files we'll click ok and now we have a folder let's delete that old uh, zip file now we have this folder where you extracted the thing now you have two information uh, two uh, some files where minecraft uh, installer files are and you have the installer and instructions. So if you want, if you need help, you can read this instruction. So what you have to do is right click on this install Minecraft Education Edition, right click on it and click run as administrator. Click yes. If you need a password, type that in. So all you have to do is wait for this to finish. It's installing. You can see the progress bar. All right, guys, I think it finished installing. Let's click here. Uh, I don't see anything, but I think it finished installing. So what you're going to do is click start and click all apps. And we're going to go to M. For Minecraft, and as you can see, Minecraft Education Edition it's set as new. So we could pin this to the Start menu, pin this to Start, and you could see you here we have Minecraft Education Edition. So I'm going to move this all the way up, right here, beside Minecraft Windows 10 Edition, so you could see the difference. We have a different icon. Let's set increase the tile size to see what different 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 tile size icon looks like this is the normal minecraft and this is the education edition you could see again the steve uh, alex and that chemistry thing uh, the organic chemistry thing and there's the minecraft normal minecraft under standard edition let's do what see what the wide icon looks like looks like this green nice green color and wide so it's kind of not not bad so we're going to we're going to compare this and this so let's start minecraft see what happens Okay, as you can see, it immediately asks me to log into my school account. Now, if you try to log into your normal Microsoft account, it's not going to work. I'm going to show you what happens when you do that. So I'll be back. I'll, I'm going to log into my Microsoft account, and I want to show you the message you get. Uh, but first, it says, please sign in with your school account to play Minecraft Education Edition. Uh, if your teacher has approved your Microsoft account, you can use that. So be in, be back in a sec. So as you can see, I logged into my uh, account. It says uh, Microsoft account. So it says this account is not eligible to for Minecraft Education Edition. So I'm going to see. I just want to show you what happens if you try to log into your normal account. All right, guys. So I logged into my school account. As you can see, this is Minecraft Education Edition. It's uh, now I have the main menu right there. Education is a nice blue blob. <laughs> 
<laughs> blocks. It's a, it's a nice blue box, and it says "Smile for the Camera." And you could see my name right there, Nazma says. It took from my anniversary profile the my name. It, it recognized my name. And here you could click here to see all your Minecraft Education Edition skins. Uh, these are all free. There's nothing paid here. But I recognize some of these skins, especially this one and this one as well from the regular Minecraft. So I think they picked some of the awesome skins from the regular Minecraft uh, Pocket Edition and Windows 10 Edition and put them here for free. I don't know if in the future there will be paid packs. I don't think so because that's not the point of Education Edition. <coughs> so it's But for, as of now, there's nothing paid here. <coughs> so you click back. There's also no way to import a skin. So that's interesting. Uh, also, let's take a look at the options. Uh, before that, look at this version number. It's a uh, version 0 0.4. 14.2. That's the same version that's uh, currently of our Pocket Edition for iOS, Android, and Windows Phone, and it's also the same version that uh, Windows 10 uh, Edition has. So this is basically the exact same edition as the Pocket version, Pocket Edition. So it has the same features as the Pocket Edition. So plus some education components. So you can't change your name. This locked this based on your uh, university. I turned the music down, uh, uh, and also the sound is fine. Uh, let's go here. All these options are just like the Pocket Edition. You could change your field of view, render distance, full screen, or not. And let's get started. And now here, you don't have the Realms option, just like you do in the Windows 10 Edition. Uh, you could create a new world or import one. I'm going to import my world. Let's do that. I'm going to go to my. Uh, I'm, I have a. I have uh, my world saved from the Windows 10 Edition. I want to import that. Um, Nazmus's world. Okay, so it imports the world fine. It says I last made a change week a week ago. And it's in a creative mode. I was building an awesome uh, ch uh, like adventure world, and uh, this is underground. I created um, uh, an underground uh, haven or living place for me. There's a secret door thanks to Adiath who who helped me create the secret pathway. Uh, I created this ladder, but he he taught me to make this the a secret door in the painting, and. Uh, as you can see, by mistake, I'm gonna have to close the door first without uh, falling down. So I'm gonna close the door. There. Uh, so he told me how to. He taught me how to make a secret door behind a painting. But as you can see, this is Minecraft. Um, just uh, just like the Pocket Edition. All the items options you have are same as the those for Pocket Edition. So if there's a new, uh, so there's no end portal, but there's Nether. Nether. Uh, so anything you get on the pocket, you get here. All the enchantments and uh, inventory and chests you could open up. Um, so let's take a look. So everything you get here is just like the pocket edition. And I, I, I made some grass underground. Um, and also, I'm, I'm working on to make a really nice. Um, it's not nice yet, but I'm working on to make a platformer. So. I'm I'm it's it's I'm I'm just beginning when I start flying. So I want to make a way to like a challenging platformer. You have to go all the way from down here, you have to go all the way up there without falling. I'm not sure if I should put lava in the bottom yet, but I guess you could do a playthrough with that and see how it's like. Um there you go. Like that. We're platforming. So yeah, you could do anything you want. Uh this is just normal Minecraft. There's I have not seen any difference between this and the pocket edition yet. So there we have it. Oh, whoops! I'm not doing very good. Uh, whoa. Okay. So all you have to do is uh, go grab on there. Yep, like that, like that, like that, and there you go. I'm getting there. See, uh, you can. I, I I was able to go over there. So I'm not gonna bore you with that right now. So, but I also made this weird under underwater room over there. So there's like underwater. This is below the ocean. So I both made this under the sea. Like the big uh, water section, I, you know, the the lake, the sea, whatever you call it. I build this room under there, and if you break one of these, you'll see water pouring in. So I'm going to need to put um, glass so I, I could quickly close it. So I'm going to put a glass here, and I'm going to break this. As you can see, water pours in. No, 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 no. There we go. Safe. Safe. I don't want any of these water to destroy my... Um, my lamps but yeah so this is minecraft education edition uh you can play with other players in uh you could i believe you could play up to with up to 30 players in your classroom so m m most classroom have 24 to 30 students so most students will be able to enjoy and build stuff together especially when you have redstone and comparatives comparators and these redstone log logic are r a really good way to teach students about computers 
and how uh, circuits and uh, logic boards work. It's very awesome. I think Minecraft is a great game, especially for learning. So yeah, this is my world. I'm working on it. I'm working on a like underground challenge environment. But yeah, it's gonna be. It's a long way from finishing, but. Yeah, I guess I could make a playthrough of that. So, yeah, let me know what you think, guys. If you like this video, if you like Minecraft Education Edition, if you have more questions, definitely let, 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 let me know. I'll definitely try to answer the question. By the way, if you do install Minecraft Edition, Education Edition, you'll get automatic updates. So you'll get all the future uh, future build, uh, items that the Pocket Edition gets. You'll also get immediately or close to immediately. Uh, it'll, it'll, it will be de de delivered by the Windows Store. I'm not sure uh, how it'll be updated in the Windows uh, uh, Macintosh version in El Capitan. I'm guessing it has an auto updater. I'll, I'll, I'll have to ask someone. Someone. I have to see if some. some uh, let me know if you one of you play this on the Mac. Let me know how it gets updated on the Mac. But in the Windows 10, it's going to be updated automatically through the store once you install it. So yeah, this is Minecraft Education Edition. I hope you have a great uh, experience with this if you can play it. If you if you are a teacher or a student and you are using this in your classroom, definitely let me know. So this has been the first gameplay video of Minecraft Education Edition. So yes, thank you guys. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll have more Minecraft videos and other gaming videos and other technology videos on this channel. So you'll be the first to know. So have a good one, guys.